about a homicide and inside an apartment complex on Lindell Boulevard. It happened inside of Coronado Place and Tower Apartments, just steps away from St. Louis University's campus. Good evening, I'm Ann Allred. And I'm Mike Borsch. Police tell us tonight they are still looking for the shooter. Five on your side's Diamond Palmer has been digging up information about the number, uh, about the amount of number of times police have been called to the off-campus apartment building. St. Louis police say since January 2022, they've been called to Coronado Place and Tower Apartments at the corner of Spring and Lindell 267 times. The majority of the calls were for suspicious activity, stolen cars, domestic disturbances, and gunshots. The Better Business Bureau giving a D minus rating with a dozen complaints from residents in the last 12 months. Police say they responded to the building once again Tuesday evening around 8 for a shooting. St. Louis University student Ben Schaefer has lived at the apartments for a year. He says he was parking his car when he saw suspicious looking people enter the side of the building. About half an hour later, I went back to my apartment and I heard what I thought were two gunshots right below me. Schaefer says he felt his whole apartment shake. Police say they found a 21 year old man shot in the chest and recovered drugs and drug paraphernalia from the scene. Schaefer wants more protection and he says there's only one security guard at the apartment at night and some of the exterior doors don't have key fob entry. You have a lot of activity on, on this corner that just isn't focused on and that can lead to dangerous situations. Students I talked to say if it wasn't for the low price and the proximity to SLU's campus, they wouldn't live at Coronado Apartments because of the amount of crime. People are just going to continue to live here no matter how bad it gets. Julian Harvey, another SLU student who also lives at the apartments, says he doesn't blame the apartments management for the issues. More about the, the area and some bigger problems in the city rather than the building itself, but also this doesn't happen at other places where people live around here. so. Reporting in St. Louis, Diamond Palmer, five on your side. And five on your side has reached out to Graystar, the apartment's management, by phone and email, and they have not responded to our request to comment. Meantime, St. Louis University leaders sent an email to students offering them counseling services if they need it.